This is Miss D, and I have a project to share. I want to show you a project that I actually made using this egg carton from the Target Dollar Spot, Bullseye Playground, whatever they call it now. Yeah, and it's just a craft uh, egg carton, and I think I want to make my grandkids... Um, a project using this carton. I think it's just too cute. But anyway, yeah, so I'll have to get the fillable eggs to put in there because I want to put little treats in there for them. But I also wanted to make one that you actually send to someone as a gift. If it's a crafty buddy, you put craft items in it. If it's just for a person, you could put little candies and little things that, you know, um, are that they're familiar with. Yeah, but this is the carton that I made. Yes, there it is, and I'm going to just show you um, all of the little stuff that I have hanging off of it. I think I want to put a word back here too. Yeah. This is the bottom side of it. And this is, okay, so I'll let you know exactly what I did to make this egg carton. I, what I intended to do was cover it with lace first, but uh, that wasn't my initial thought. So I actually covered it with the lace pieces, the lace trim, and then I had an afterthought and said, no, you need to cover it with the trim. I painted it pink first, and then I put on my trim, which I should not have done. This is how I should have done it. I have another one going, and here it is, and I'll show you when it's complete. I should have covered it with the lace first. And this is another one in purple that I'm working on. So, as you can see, I actually covered it with the lace first. Okay, so then once you cover it with the lace, you just add the little pieces. Here, I have this medallion with a cabochon in there with the little metal piece. I used some deco, uh, not decoupage, what is that? Gesso to kind of tone down that color. I have some Chanel stems there, some roses, bows, you name it, I have it there. Some little sparklies. Yeah, just to bring it together. This right here is some trim that I got from AliExpress. My little roses. I got those from the porcelain roses. I got those from AliExpress too. And from what I see, yeah, these are still available. The big ones are not no longer available. This is nail art, and uh, yeah, I have trim all around it, and as you can see, I have the lace on there too. I have this same trim 
on the back side of it which is this right here and I get it from AliExpress too as you can see I have 20 yards of it it's not that much I think it's like six dollars for uh, 10 yards probably not even six dollars but yes yeah, so I just got 20 yards of it because I know I would use it a lot I like that I think it's pretty so I use that to put on the front on the back here and the front um, I have uh, some seam binding there I get my seam binding in bulk from so true I think it is yeah Dot com it's a website I have some little pearl beads here that I use to just cascade down I have some little word images there a little bow that I get from paper mark a little another piece of sequin there that's off color I made this little itty bitty tussie mussy I had it from a leftover project I did before so I actually put it attached it on here then I have a chain here with a crown and then a little dangle there and on the other side I just have this metal dangle I think this is either I am roses or mm, what's the other one um, I don't know but it's another flower company that I ordered my mulberry flowers and stuff from um, yeah so that's that yeah, so that is then some pearls, some little faux pearls, yeah, um, trim. And, uh, yeah, these are, I don't know which flowers, but some maybe I am roses, and then some are the other company. I can't remember what they are, but, yeah, I still order from both of them. But I don't need any more flowers right now, so I haven't ordered or trim or anything. So I haven't ordered anything from them lately. And as you can see, the bottom, I have lace that I put on. And I had, and, and on the bottom of it, I actually used felt to put on the edges of the, the um, things. And inside, as you can see, the top part of it, I have some little crochet doilies that I put on here some of these are doilies that I got from either Aliexpress or someone sent them to me I can't remember who but I did the same thing to the inside there I used the little Michael word beads um, these flowers are cheap trim little ombre ombre roses yeah so and then in here and because I had turned this upside down I have some of the little flat back pearl in here. I made a little pin cushion and in there I made some little pins that go in there but because this closes I figured I would keep them down in there. Here are some little pieces there that I have and here is another pin that I made and if you keep this open you could actually take these little pins and stick them down in here they may close it might close with it but because I wasn't certain I just put them laid them in here then I put some little washi tape in there this is great for a person to actually do crafts because then they could use these items that you put in there and then I have some of the little ombre flowers in there but there's also a little flower that I put in there to hold the um, I have some little beads I'm putting in here too so they'll go in there and then these are like I said the flat back trim and I get it from AliExpress too it comes like 25 yards on here and I think this is only like five or six dollars for a 25 yard roll so it's cheaper to get it for me that way than it is for me to order it by the yard um, I have little and I'm trying to get the little glue boogers out of there yeah so I have a flower here a little bow that I got from Paper Mart and I made this little flower underneath it yeah and that's pretty much it 
there that is my um, egg carton aren't they cute you could do so much for it, it just happened to be pink uh, a lot of people think pink is my favorite color I don't have a favorite color you guys I like all of the colors I'm just here lately noticing that I'm using a lot of pink and sometimes I do but this closes up it has a little one of those little chains there are word word links there too and it says dream this one says create and this one says inspire but yeah that is my egg carton I think it's really pretty I think if you send this to a person that actually loves to do craft they can actually sit it look at it and be inspired to create something of their own yeah so there you are Thanks for watching, everyone. Talk to you later. Bye.